Hello, I am talking to figurative sculptor Mr. Eduardo Gomez about memorial sculptures. How are you today? Hi, Annette. How are you? I'm doing great, thanks. So can you tell us, please, what a memorial is? A memorial is a commissioned work of art that commemorates a person, an event, or an idea. And are memorials about people who are no longer alive? Not really. There is a modern trend to do a living memorial. Partly because people, some people can afford it, mm -hmm. and partly because they want to be themselves part of an artistic experience. Okay. Uh, more and more and more people are commissioning living memorials of loved ones, mm -hmm. of events in their lives, of pets, yes. and even of themselves. Interesting. And so then why do you like doing this type of work? Because it allows me the privilege of coming in close contact with the subject or the event in the memorial. For example, mm -hmm. in creating the maquette for the U.S. Navy SEAL memorial, I was able to meet some of these heroes face to face. So then why does the closeness matter to you, Mr. Eduardo? Because I find the beauty, mm -hmm. the duality, and the drama of the human spirit fascinating. Why are the artist's personal experiences important? Because what really makes a work of art truly unique and different and interesting is the artist's personal interpretation of the subject or the event. Can you elaborate a bit more on the artist's interpretation, please? Yeah. Uh, reality portrayed through the artist's unique perspective. Mm -hmm. Unlike a history or a written biography, a memorial sculpture has to capture the essence of a complex person or an event in one shot. Okay, so if we were to put what you say in literary terms, a sculptor, sculpture would be more like a poem about reality uh, than a novel or even a short story. Yes, well put. Sculpture is a visual poem. I like that idea. Thank you.